You don't deserve an Amanda Bynes comeback. You don't deserve it. You, the public, don't deserve it. I am so happy that she's getting better and looks better and has life in her eyes. But, and I appreciate everything she does giving back to the public, but I don't think the public deserves her because you never apologise for the way you treated her in 2013. She worked 10 years straight, a decade of her life on television, surrounded by some of the most awful people in the Hollywood. And she only got quote-unquote famous, popular... In 2013, and it it sickens me that that happened. And I don't feel like we have ever said, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm so, 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 so sorry that you had to go through that. And we put you through that. We, as, 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 as a, as a, as a worldwide culture, we... We we did that. It it makes me feel sick, and I just I want to say sorry. I want everybody to say sorry to Amanda Bynes, please. Anyway, if you are one of the nice people out there, because we I exist, you exist. Um, we all make mistakes, and we can apologize and say I'm sorry, Amanda Bynes, and I. I'm so excited for the future. This podcast, it sounds a great idea. It sounds like you're surrounded by a great number of people. And I'm really excited. I really wish you all the best for 2024.